सिफर सी सिक्स या नाउ व्हाट आर यू प्लेइंग हेड वी गेट स्लाब राइट गोस टू स्लाब सेम स्लाब बोथ ओके दे डोंट शो व्हाट दे आर गोइंग तो आई टेक द पॉन सेम स्लाब ओके नॉट स्लाब you take i don't <laughs> i prefer more closed positions uh so like i get well both of us would play knight c3 here though right no 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 oh. i would take and play then play knight c3 oh oh you play exchange okay i i play exchange sometimes hey, rapid play exchange variation okay yeah i i do that too sometimes and then like Bishop g5 and then queen c2. Yeah, that type of. Okay, this method. is actually uh, X variation. So who wanted to actually play slight advantage, and you don't need to actually get some complication or something like that. If you wanted to play actually slight advantage for white, I play fast move. So then play. Okay, X is not good in slab. Uh, sorry, not bad at all in slab. Okay, X is good. White has some initiative in F a. Not this too much, but some initiative in after op after opening finish. Okay, yeah, but okay, we wanna play main line. This is the good. Okay, but yeah, in in Karakwan exchange is not good in lots of opening. You can play with white side exchange. This is going to be very easy for black. Okay, even this is a completely equal position. Mm -hmm. But yeah, but on the in the Same is love. Yeah, this is not actually a very going to equal anymore. Anymore. Okay, so in club exchange is is okay. Not yeah. Bad. When you play friends, you are you get exchange. This is the bad, uh, actually equal. And you are playing uh, against Karo Khan. You are playing exchange because some variation white has some initiative. Like if uh, if for. C6, D4, D5, take, take, C4. The only variation you can get some small initiative. Otherwise, if you play normal chess, when black can trying to play for initiative. Okay, mm -hmm. but uh, in the semi slab, okay, white no the white no good in with white piece. Then yeah, you can pressure all the time in your opponent. Okay, so let's see. Okay, what do you want to see? Main line or exchange variation? It's your wish. We, we, you both can discuss. Then we can. I can show. Well, I would vote on the what I play personally, which is this one. But it's up to Kevin, I guess. Oh man, no man, you're 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 a lesson. Um, I I do play this line as well. So, okay, I'm curious. I'm curious to see what you do. You <laughs> do like uh, you do the like attacking. Attacking line roughly with queen c two bishop. Uh, I wish I could control the board, but like queen c two, uh, bishop d three, bishop g five, uh, knight. Yeah, yeah, I can understand. You are playing this, but what do you wanna actually see today? So we can. I think we would. We can, we can just look at this line right here. Yeah, let's just go. Let's just go with this line. <laughs> So, knight f6. I personally play bishop f4 here. Yeah, even even you can. Yeah, bishop f4 is good. Bishop f4. Okay, oh, bishop. interesting. Okay. Because of yeah, the diagonal is very important. Okay, so bishop diagonal. Even you, oh, black can exchange the d6. Uh, black bishop with d6. This is a not actually going to be bad. Okay, here the important thing is white bishop. Okay, you, you need to understanding white white bishop. Okay, and black black bishop are very strong. Right. And it's exchange variation because when your bishop one put on d3, he cannot exchange with any bishop. Okay, yes. he can play bishop f5, but bishop f5 some problem. He can come bishop b3 or something like that. You can play bishop f4, knight b5. 
you can put the a6 then he can play knight a4 he was trying to play knight b6 sometime play rook c on yeah some positional stuff is coming okay so he, he cannot actually exchange the white bishop easily mm -hmm. okay so yeah no problem here he can exchange the bishop with this okay after this you can go 95 or something okay we, we just show Then I play um, e3. Okay, e3, yes. Knight e3, both are same. Here, okay, a6. So, a6 idea, you understand what the idea for a6? Um, so, yeah. Yeah, so sometimes you can go knight b5, okay. So he just stop this. Okay, also he has time to play actually b5, b5, knight a5, knight c3, knight c4. Okay, he has some idea, okay, but this is not easy to do this. Bishop b3, obviously here bishop b3 is very important because you can, here you cannot play actually knight a3, you can play, but knight is, I, I feel this is not good. Because he can play here, if you can play knight f3, then he can play bishop f5. Okay, this is the equal completely. But okay, bishop d3 is look like in the in beginner level, bishop d3 is look like very dangerous. Okay, because he's threatening to a7, your bishop c8 on passive, oh, oh, where he go, he can go bishop g4. Okay, but okay, they need to actually lost some. Move. So another reason why I don't commit the knight is because I want to see if they'll play e6 next. If so, then I'll commit the knight to f3. And if not, my knight is going to go on e2. Yeah. You can go. This is your wish. OK, if you want, then you can go. Otherwise, yeah, you can go knight f3. So you have two options, OK? Just that, uh, but also, um, hey, I have a question here. So after a6, does white ever play just a4? Like, do I B4. need to stop this uh, B5 move? Yeah. Yeah, B5 is not bad. Why you, you, you not, for, not bad for me? Okay, so if okay. you have B5, there is no problem for me. So he can, he can, okay. He can, when he play B5, he gets some, yeah, he have some space advantage. Okay, mm -hmm. your pawn, he can move the pawn or something like that. But there is some weakness because of, he has coordinating, C6 knight is unprotected. Bishop f1 is, yeah, the controlling diagonal. So you cannot push b4. You can, okay, but yeah, this is, you can sometime, but most of the time you cannot do because you, you can just, I go just knight a4 and play rook c1 and knight c5. Okay, you, you see, rook c diagonal is very, it's, even sometime I played a4. Okay, when I played a4, you need to play b5. Then mm -hmm. I go like knight b on knight d to knight b3. Okay, some okay. additional stuff is coming. So main point okay, is so that b5 is not something to be scared yeah. of. We should uh, we should allow yeah, you, b5. Yeah, you, you can allow. Okay, this is okay. no problem. B5 is not good actually for black. Okay. A5 is positional mistake actually. B5 is power. He can go. He can go. Before Bishop before and knight before, yeah. We give up b4 square too early in the game. I, I get that. Yeah. Not only b5, we can move also knight b5, queen a5, everything is coming very fast. Okay. Yeah, yeah, you're right. You're right. Makes sense. Bishop c4 is the most actually, this is the best move for actually black here. Okay, mm -hmm. the idea is I told you that white bishop is very strong. Your white yeah. bishop. Okay. So he wanted to attack your queen. Also, sometime he played bishop h5 and bishop g6. Okay, he wanted to exchange your bishop. Yes. Okay, so how much this bishop is strong? He moved actually bishop g4, bishop h5, bishop g6. He wanted to, he played three moves to exchange your bishop. Okay, right. so I don't need to actually explain more. I don't right. Need to. So, 92, so 93, okay, we can play, but okay, just yeah, knight. It yeah, 92 is, is okay. preferred, I think. Yeah, because why 92 is good? Because you sometimes it's later you can play. Okay, your opponent cannot break. There is one way to break the structure. That is, this is e5. Okay. 
So e5 he cannot play easily because when he played e5, d5 is weak. Okay, but you have you need to break. Okay, he is just he don't know, do nothing, but you are playing, so you need to break. So how to break this system? Okay, I have a question. I have a question. So what if he just plays knight h5 here and picks up that dark square bishop? Yeah. Yeah. He played back to G3, G, G, well, he, not right now, but... Maybe this is not, because he can play bishop e5 here. Mm -hmm. Bishop e5. Bishop e5? Yeah. Yeah, and you're not afraid of the double bonds. The thing is, when you take, I take, and I wanted to play f3 and g4, the knight is step. Basically, those black pieces are going to spend all this time. Okay, you can take, I can take. Oh, you need to play g6, and when I play f3, you need to go knight, a bishop, while then play knight g7. Yeah, you can play, but... I don't think this is not good, actually. Can you show me the possibilities? So, for yeah, like that, guys. Yeah. Okay, just I see, see you there. White's going to launch all of his pawns and then King's side pretty quickly, Rafi. Okay, uh, so, so now I am telling you to play... Okay. Yeah, Rafi. Yeah. Now I am telling you to play 3 g4. Okay, you cannot protect a, anything to move beside the g6. Okay, so g6. So even I don't need to play actually f3 here, I play just b3. Oh, I was thinking f3 right away, but okay. Okay. Can you play f3 right away here instead of queen uh, b3? What? f3. Just right away, f3. Pawn to f3. f3. Okay, you can play, but after queen b3, the, the same thing. I just took, took a pawn, free. Yeah, this is also good, but okay. So, but yeah, a pawn is a pawn. There is passive structure for black. Okay, we see that. Okay, but yeah, not bad like that, not compared to pawn. Okay, a pawn is a pawn. When you don't have any composition with pawn, okay, you can take. I gotcha. Okay, so just queen b3 is better attacking first. Okay. I just wanted to see it, sorry. What if... um. What if he doesn't take the bishop on e5 and he plays, I don't know, maybe f6 or something like that? f6. Sure, let's go with that. Okay, it's three. I guess he has to settle for that g6 stuff, right? So bishop takes, I guess, e2. Queen takes, and now he has to play g6, I think, right? Yeah, just when I move the bishop, then bishop back to h2. Yeah, you can just play bishop h2, and white is definitely better here now. Yeah, not better. This is completely better. Yeah. Agreed. Yeah. Okay. How to actually improve the position for black side? Okay, you can. You need to where go your bishop and knight. Okay, he castle and play rook c on or rook d on and play e4. Makes sense. Okay. So, knight is five is not good here. Okay. Okay, when you play, yeah, like bishop g3, then you can even lots of time. Okay, you play knight is five or white play bishop is five. Okay, sometimes you can play f6. Okay, but here yes, F6 is not good. Okay. Got it. So E6, that's the normal move actually. So I wanted to improve my position and casting. I've always played Rook C1 here. What? I've always played Rook C1 personally here. <clears throat> yeah, but. C1, you don't have a, a not serious thing. Okay, because he cannot go knight b5 or he cannot do anything here. So, first of all, he can, he can play, but okay, first of all, I like that you, you need to play king safety, then you can play it next. 
I think the idea of Rook C1 is to stop Knight B4, right? Knight B4 he cannot play actually. He play what the problem? You just play Knight Bishop B1. And next move you play H3. Okay, then play Bishop D3. Okay, no, no problem here. Gotcha. Okay, fair enough. When you need to stay beyond, then yeah, this is not good actually. But you don't need to actually stay beyond. Yeah. Okay. So castle, yeah, castle is the good actually. There is no problem here. Yeah, bishop b seven. Okay, bishop b seven. We can see that later. So bishop d six is the only move actually to actually play for actually equality. Okay. Otherwise, this is not actually equality is not actually good. So in this position, I actually take the bishop. You can take the bishop or play f3. Okay, you, you can choose. I have usually taken and played f4, actually. You want to play f4? Yeah. I played the queen c2 and then f3 or f3. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. you cannot play Kelvin. You cannot play queen c2. Okay, because of knight b4 is coming. Right, okay, right, right, right. Here actually the bishop queen c2 is not good because now c file is open. Okay. Yeah. You can have a you know, even give serious state your next move, then you can play. Otherwise, this is not good because of uh, you can you don't need to play bishop b5. Okay, bishop b5 is good. Even bishop b5 is completely equal, but okay, rook c8, you have need to scary about this. Okay, you cannot stay actually queen c2 is. So, okay. Okay, but okay. Let's see bishop d6 first, because that's what I've been playing and it's been okay so far. This whole idea of taking on d6 and playing f4 comes up in many times in this opening, actually. Many different ways. Yeah, bishop d6. Yeah. We play many times. Yeah, this is a line that me and Shrey developed. I think I told you about this one. So this arises out of many differences, other uh, move order also. But as soon as the yeah, bishop comes but, to d6, but, yeah, you just change it left. I, I don't like your move. Okay, so if actually, you... actually, to be honest with you, now that I think about it, that that idea of f4 usually comes after when you haven't committed the knight to e3. Uh, e3. I've never seen this type of move before. Yeah, actually, it's. I just realized it's more. Co it's really for when you your knight is still on g1, so then you play knight knight f3 here. Yeah. Okay. So, yeah, you can play knight f3. Then yeah, this is not going to bad. Yeah. Okay, because you can yeah. go knight f f5 or something. When bishop on c8. Okay, there is no problem. But here is you can actually I don't know what is the plan next for uh, white. Yeah, no, it, it doesn't make as much sense now with the knight on e2. I agree. Yeah. Yeah. So, okay, so you can, yeah, here you can play just f3. Okay, there is, when you take, you take with knight, okay. Huh. Why you need to take, yeah? What's wrong with, um... okay, never mind, yeah, sure. Okay, you can take bishop d6, okay, but here queen on d6, okay. You're just helping so, him develop the queen, yeah. That's fair. Yeah, but uh, he he can he take then your knight going to f going to f four, okay. So yeah. gain on okay, that's why you can play. So bishop is five. Yeah, now we can play rook c on. Okay, you can take any time, but oh, I don't actually I don't see any actually why I take. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I, when I force, then I can take. Otherwise, why I take? I. I, I think some I people take. To... I think some people take it early because one of the ideas in this opening is to play a quick knight a four, knight c five. They want to get that c five square as quickly as possible. Yeah, but black okay. has to make some concessions to get the knight out of okay. c five in this so you, opening. Okay, you wanna play? The, you don't need to actually hurry. Um, okay, you can play next if you want. Because gotcha. after rook c on, he cannot play actually a b5. Because you can maybe take the 95 also. Right. Because you see rook c6 is angry. Okay. Yeah, rook c on is very developing move. Yeah, you on rook c on this 
this this a1 root is only good is square to c1 or d1 okay so you can go see on this is the file open file so open file is the important for any kind of position mm -hmm. okay rook c1 okay cast it so this is you can play okay but okay Okay, we can see the sum game. What happening? But now the preparing is very tough because in please and rapid only all the top player are playing main line. Other is they are playing very side line even very worst opening. Okay, so you don't not do anything that. Just waiting and play something like that. This is now this is very boring. Yeah. So, castle, knight a4, okay, I told you that, this is the one of the idea, so going to knight c5, okay, because when black bishop is on, not on the board, so knight c5 is very strong, okay, so you cannot push to b6, because I take just a5, a, a6 pawn, okay, so even you can play any other move, then you need to actually protect your b7 for a long time. Okay. okay so I have another you, question. You, I have another yeah. question. Yeah. Um, you know, you said that the black, white bishop is so powerful and all this stuff, right? So yeah. from a clearly principled standpoint, wouldn't it make sense for me to quickly exchange the dark square bishop, play knight f4 and grab that light square bishop from, from black? So instead of knight a4, I play bishop yeah, b6 but, 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 and play knight. Yeah, go bishop g6. Yeah. He, okay, you can play knight b6. He can play actually. You can not get to play knight a4. Okay, he can play here bishop g6. Then when you take this a uh, g6 stuff, then this yeah. is not your your white bishop is not actually now not good anymore. Okay, it's because it's better because now a g6. Pawn on a7, yeah. pawn on g6. Okay. The block in the a7 is square. So that's the reason. That makes sense. I got you. I got you. Okay, you can play, but okay. You, the, you don't actually get this type of advantage. What I tell no. you. No, I think I think I, I like your move better now. I may, I may, this makes more sense. Okay. So, okay. So, bishop g6. So knight c5, okay. So my idea is I am going to play knight c5. Okay, here you can take bishop c5. Okay, but bishop c5 when you take the black bishop is goes to very strong because you cannot take black bishop and black bishop controls e5 diagonal. E5 is a very important diagonal for black. Okay. Only way to play slab or semi-slab, you need to break the e4 e black side. Okay. When you pick easily e5 and c5, then you get actually equal position. There is only idea to get equal position. Otherwise, back is always like that. Okay, in after 20 move, you don't break the e5 structure, then this position is bad for black. So okay. what happens Why if is... black what if happens if black takes on c5 then plays knight h5 here? Black takes c5. Yeah. Same thing with bishop. Wait, I can play this, this. This is the very strong now. Because yeah. that time you can go knight g6. Now you can never go knight g6. Um. Okay. Yeah, makes sense. 
Okay, okay can play. You can take. You can take and you can play like this, but there is nothing needed. Wait, wait. Can I can I, can I go back for a second okay. to that that yeah that line? Okay. Queen C two. Can he just not take Bishop uh, uh, D three? Okay. He, I think, yeah, you can't play Queen C two here. Yeah, I can. Queen's over there. <laughs> okay, do I need to check? I can take see first. That. Yeah. Yeah, Rafi, you are afraid I will take your uh, you give bishop. Okay. Yeah. Okay, you are very feel very bad. Then you can take this one first. Okay. So but I don't want to. Um, yeah. I don't want to voluntarily take on g6 though. That just helps black, I think. Okay. If you don't do this, then after that you can take this. Then play knight c5. Yeah, because yeah, now bishop e5 is not. Uh, you cannot play because he just take. Mm. Okay, because queen b6. Okay. Queen B6 is coming next. This is the problem actually. Otherwise, you can play. So going back to that six sequence we just talked about, if that did happen on the board, like let's just say we did, you know, he did play. Um, so play knight f4. So then, uh, yeah, knight c5. You wanted to play g5 or something like. The knight c5. Take bishop takes c5 and then rook takes knight h5. What is my what should my move be here? Actually, you just play h3, there is no problem here because all the all the control are your side. Okay, you don't have better. Uh, I don't, I don't tell you this is a better for you, but yeah, this is the comfortable position for you. Yeah, if he takes okay, an F4. I don't, have, I don't have no problem, so I take yeah, with this. Yeah, I'm bring. So he needs to take, otherwise I take with knight. Okay. Um. Yeah, sure. And there's no like E5 type of stuff here or anything like that? Uh, yeah, I guess E5. Yeah. yeah. No, no, I was looking at E5, but there's knight takes D5, I think. Yeah. So here, okay, you have controlling um, lots of this square. You have root C file. Okay, so yeah, you want to play exchange variation. This is like you need to accept this type of variation. Mm. So you need to play very complicated and get lot a uh, very at, very good advantage at time to play for a bit long and. Good advantage, then you need to play main line. Otherwise, right. it, this is playing. Okay. So you need to play slight advantage. Your opponent play very accurately, then you need to play slight advantage. This is not actually slight, some advantage. Okay. Yeah. But there yeah. is not easy to play for black hair. Okay, you don't you can play just look C on, play A3, B5, okay. Some you, he don't he don't push any pawn. Yeah. Okay, there is some actually Okay, he can play rook c8, you can play, sometimes he can rook, he can move knight e, e7, okay, you can play a6, a3, b5, when you take, you take with b, b pawn, mm. okay, there is something, because you need, you attack b7, okay. Like that. No, he cannot play actually in d seven. Okay, because you are telling okay play a six. Just to move the knight d three also, he can play. Yeah, I think white should be fine here. No major 
even why does control controlling is very good here yeah so black, black and do not get this black get yeah He should. He can. He should hope that he can somehow trade off all the major pieces here, or, or else he's going to be in pro problem, right? Because, um, when like A4, four, B four stuff yeah, coming. Can, okay, but okay, can play B five arrows. So there is no mm. problem. You know so we right. can even if you can take with pawn also, no problem here. So you can play long term advantage. Yeah. This is a, uh, this is also equal, but yeah, but in practically this is not that like of equal. Right. Because you can play rook b b six, queen b four. Sometimes you put the knight on c on b three a five. Right. Yeah, I I don't told you that that move. I, I don't I I don't tell you that that is, is something different move because of you don't give the bishop all the time. That's why I told you that. Mm -hmm. Got it. Otherwise, I played then I played this surely. Oh, sorry. Okay, we, do, we just see the some game. Okay, very fast. So because lots of game is in this type of variation is this or. In top 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 level, you don't have actually too much game. Top level, all the player are playing for fair black side is bishop to see. They did didn't guess it. Mm-hmm. Okay, bishop. G six. Have you heard about a player? Um. Kelvin, what is the best player? There is multiple, not the best. What do you actually feel comfortable here? Strategically, you don't want to trade. White doesn't want to trade. Uh, white. Strategically, white does not want to trade light square bishops from memory in this opening, right? So uh, e4, we're looking to play e4. Uh, might be a little too early right now, but yeah, uh, but here he cannot play because e5 he can play. When he play e5 very easily, e4 he cannot. He can play e5 or something like that. Right, but it is not easy so, to play when you play. There is two hair going to something. So, you want to prepare if four, yeah, more. This e4 idea that Kevin is talking about is more so when black, uh, in the queen's gambit decline lines, right? When black still has a pawn on uh c6, that's true, and the e pawn is gone, then you prepare f3 e4 later on. But I think with the pawn, with this kind of Slav exchange. This e4 idea is kind of like I don't know, Naim. You can tell maybe share, but I think it's really difficult to get it to work, right? Yeah, when you play, like, actually, if I, you don't have chance to play e4, e4. Right. Okay. You can do because when you play, you need to put on rook e on, and on rook put on b on. Okay, you can do this, this two, then you can play e4. Otherwise, yeah, but otherwise this is very hard to play this. Yeah, that was my understanding too. Okay, interesting. But that is definitely the idea in the other variation, you know, when, yeah. when black plays, he takes e5. Yeah. 
Yeah, even lots of lots of in D4 the opening. Yeah. D4 is very common. F3, even right. if, even we uh, roughly you see this line. Nimjo Indian, okay. Nimjo Indian on variation in AX. Nimjo Indians. Uh, C takes D5, okay. Variation, yeah. This is the common thing play E4 and the F3 for. Uh, Maybe you can remember, okay. We see, we just see one time, that's why you cannot remember. A lot of opening here, F3 for this stuff is. So nine and four. Okay, so we don't need to actually forecasting yeah go, going to same actually okay both are same actually okay. so we just see very fast so follow and here fast break this is okay take bishop d6 then queen d2. Idea is I uh, protect between here. You cannot play queen b3. Okay, so because of you can take when okay. you have an extra pawn on c3, then you can. This is structure is good, but here you don't have extra pawn on c3. This is not good because. When you play, you have C3, then you can play B5. Okay, I told you roughly already. What if, what if he plays Knight H5 here? Knight here? Yeah, Knight H5. E5. H5. Okay, so. You, same thing. Problem? You just you just leave the bishop. You just let him have the bishop. Okay, you can play Bishop G5. Okay, but you don't play. There is no problem. Okay. I would almost even play just rooks FC1. Yeah, there's something. Okay, play H5, play G5, I go to Knight Bishop H2. Got it. And then like, play scary about Like these yeah. moves F6 and G5 aren't really helping black, basically, right? Yeah. It's just. Removing some shelter from his king and making e6 up. Yeah, so because now, uh, yeah, be because even here, bishop g5 is good, uh, be better than f4. Okay, mm. so because uh, you can, when you play b4, the problem is rook can go d8, okay, attack the this pawn or something like that. Okay, but he cannot go, even you cannot go knight anywhere. I can take, okay, you can go, but I can take, I have option, okay, yeah. But here you can ask this e5 is possible or not. So, okay, okay, you can play e5, just play bishop g5. Okay, no, nothing to worry. Okay, he need to take, so we can just take. Okay, okay because I, I think the thing is here, so he don't actually do nothing. He has also exchanged this pawn and now this pawn is not weak. Going some, yeah, this pawn has some weakness. Okay, because you can take any time bishop f6. Yeah. Okay, he, he, even he can play. He, he when he play rook d8, the knight is actually pin. Okay, there is some actually. That is actually good position is good for black. Okay, oh, sorry, good for white. 
about it. So we shall fight. Yeah, this is very important move. Okay, because yeah, in your level, we shall fight is more the player playing. We shall fight because we shall be play blue easy. They are wanted to actually a uh, pressure your you because of you can not you can play night before before uh, or if you don't want it to face bishop d3 also. Okay. So there is some actually problem here. So there is when you play bishop f5. So I don't need to play actually knight e2. Okay. Now I can play e5. Knight f3. Wait. Okay. So, Why not queen b3? Yeah. Yeah. Queen b3 is some problem actually. Some tactical problem. So I, I can see. Yeah, nine a five. Queen a four check. Now queen c two. I've just misplaced your bishop and knight. But no, you cannot misplace because you cannot what? play uh, rook c. The idea is now here the next move we wanted to play b five directly. Okay, let's just say I come all the way to D2, uh, D1 even. Forget the C2. D1. Queen D1. Like your yeah, knight queen... and bishop don't want to be on those squares though, really. Oh, you have queen D6. Yeah, but yeah, not good square, but what is, see the position. But you're okay. His knight, knight don't, is not on the... Good square, but your piece, what, are, what is doing on your piece? That you see. Okay, so all the pieces are improvement. Okay, not the best place. Okay, you can go best place next next later, but it's all the pieces are active. Okay, that's why going with this, yeah, some problem. Hey, do you agree with me or we can? Uh, uh, yeah, no, I think I think I agree with you. Yeah, sure. Kelvin, you are stop. You are stopping. No, so I'm you sorry. don't talk anything or you discuss. I'm still here. Just my mic's been muted. Okay, you have any question? You can ask. Okay, so this sure. is the, my habit. So that's why uh, I do, actually we are what we have to is a lot of time. So sometimes I forget you are in the call. Okay, that's <laughs> actually because. Okay, so this is actually my fault because okay, that's the actually habit. So that's why I don't actually I can not ask you so if, if you have any questions so you can ask okay no. sure yeah i'm good right now even you don't talk too much <laughs> okay. I'm I, I, quite... I and, yeah okay but you are doing actually listen okay so you don't you do do not ask then you don't actually you don't understand okay so you have Rafi's point of view is different. Your point of view is different. Okay, your think is different. Rafi's think is different. Okay, so mm -hmm. you you can ask. Okay. But here, oh, most of the player playing queen b3. Okay, we can see. Okay, why? Why they are playing? Okay, but yeah, I know that queen b3 is now not as good. So here's why my reason for why I 
like Queen B3, I used to play this, is because not every black player is going to know this kind of knight A5, bishop B7, rook C8, B5. Like at our level, people yeah, don't know I'm how playing, to yeah. take advantage of it a lot of times. They get yeah, very, uh, like, they, they get flustered when they see Queen B3. Like, oh crap, how do I defend B7? They get nervous. Yeah, here the Indian show, this is actually lots of the player, even top level, uh, white play this. Yeah. She up, she up, she even... In these queen pawn openings, queen b3 is almost always a standard reply to bishop f5, an early bishop f5, without a6 or something included. It almost always works. Okay, but yeah, but you are feel comfortable with this position, then yeah, this is okay. Um, look, but look, I at, the, look at the black pieces. Yeah. Like, black bishop has to move again, right? If he's going to castle, maybe he'll play, I don't know, g6 or something. Um, okay, black is not actually, I, I have tried about you. Okay, when I play this, I don't have any problem to play for white hair. Okay, but yeah, you are playing very solid. So the solid thing is the problem is when you have to control lots of square, and he put the knight on something like c4 square. So you are afraid, or when you we have some afraid or something yeah, like that. That's I think that's that. Okay, you are when you are feel okay. Okay, this is not worry. If you can play, then okay. So I don't have any problem. Yeah, I'm not really sure like, if I feel okay with this, honestly. Okay, the, I told you that when you top on it after queen b3. Sorry. So, after queen d3, where in black side, okay. Point of view. When your opponent, not too much. Okay, they, he can play like this. Okay, otherwise, knight a5 is look like not good. Yeah. Okay. So, you know, then he can play. Okay, you know this is a good, then you can play. Otherwise, yeah, we don't know this in your level. Yeah, knight queen this is good because your level most of the players playing queen d7. Right. Which is not good because now bishop b5, knight f3, knight e5 are coming fast. Oh, knight f3 is direct knight f5 is good because now right. you are setting to e5 is here. Yeah. Okay. I've Otherwise, had this exact same game before, in fact. Yeah, I've had a game just like this one. Yeah, I won very nicely because black just couldn't survive the attack. Like that, the, the my, like white pieces come out so fast after queen d7. Right, yeah, everything yeah, yeah, comes yeah. really fast. Yeah, yeah, queen d7 he can play. Okay, so this is a good. Even otherwise, that's knight a5 this position. Knight a5 only move to play equally. Okay, but when you, okay, but this is not easy. On your level, okay, you can prepare. Okay, I told you alternative. I see you, saw you alternative also, but yeah, okay. I like queen b3 more. Show, show me knight f3 because I'm gonna play the knight f3 line against higher rated and then against lowers, maybe I'll play like queen b3 or something. Because knight f3 is much more principled move, I think. Knight? Instead F3. of queen b3, knight f3. Box drop. Yeah, knight f3 principle. Yeah, knight f3 yeah, very look, look like very. No, knight f3. Yeah, this, this is the very most logical and more comfortable move for white. So again, here if knight h5 comes, do you still play knight bishop e5 oh, again? Knight f5. Yeah. Yeah. But well, here you can play directly. I would probably just play bishop e5 here. Yeah, bishop g5. Here you don't need to play. You can play bishop g5 there. So h6. Bishop h4. Let's just say he continues, goes all the way with it. So g5. You can play g5. Yeah. What? Oh, you're, wow. You're having your knight on h5 hanging. Oh, okay. Maybe if you take then the bishop on the yeah, five Yeah, he castle and bring all the thing, and you cannot play Made like an f7. Then knight is fighting. 
deeper point of view and this type of point of view yeah nine is full is not nine is full is not anything yeah there's some complication about this okay no no in every position okay you cannot play actually nine is five easily gotcha interesting okay you get something okay you can play then, then you get something okay you, you can just think then you can play like that no but you can not play maybe 95 you can play okay sorry because when you check if you just move this line okay there is no problem. yeah Yeah. Okay. Sounds good. Basically, like you're saying, there's no need to play H3. Before playing Knight F3, there's no, we don't have to play H3 to stop this whole business and also give the bishop a chance to hide or something because he's going to play bishop D6 anyway, right? Yeah. Okay. You can play bishop G5. Okay, Bishop, he can play Bishop D6, okay, he can, but Knight is 5 okay, you can play G, Bishop G5, you can play Bishop E5, okay, lots of, you can play. Can you even go back he, to, he, he, uh, sorry, go ahead, go ahead. Even here, he take this Bishop, this is not actually going to be bad, okay, this is going to be equal, okay, he can be equal, but here, he, 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 when he wanted to take, yeah, he play like this, and this is going to be better for him. Okay. Can, can you, you can you go back one move so, so I can see how many people are playing this H three? Why? Instead of knight F three, do they play H three? Anybody? Why play H three? Nobody plays it. Yeah, nobody's playing that. No. Okay. Okay. Playing fifteen hundred H three. Okay. Okay, but the first other is the main thing is when you don't need to move, move this pawn. Okay, so the opening principle is I need to actually improve my position. Okay, and, uh, after that, okay, there is some problem to improve, then I can play like this. Right. Okay, so we, we don't have, we, we, need, we have faced problem or something like that, then you can. Okay, but yeah, Rafi, you, you first you play with queen b3, okay. So not knight h3. I like this move for your level. Okay, you do not play against Gunmaster, so they do playing against Gunmaster, they 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 know all the thing, then you have some problem. Even if I'm playing like two thousand plus players, like two thousand to twenty two hundred, are you still think I should play Queen B three? Even Queen D seven or play any other move. Even sometimes you can play Bishop D six. This is on another move. Yeah. Maybe that I don't know, but I think that pawn. Like that loses that. the D five pawn. If I pawn, you yeah. cannot take this is the trap maybe. Oh really? That's how I told him. Yeah, ninety five. Oh E5. Yes. This queen uh, bishop b4 check is coming. I see the position before. Yeah, that hurts. Yeah, you so now if you just if you just if you just move your bishop then what happens? Yeah sure let's go yeah. with that move first. Yeah play that then what Yeah, where? No, it was it was further down. I was looking at, I was looking at the line, but I mean, most people at my level will not really play knight d seven here, you know. Knight. Most people will not know to play knight d seven here as black at at my at our level. Knight d seven. I'm saying they will not play that. 
we do, we do night day seven we don't do uh, any time so why you tell this bishop d7 nice sorry oh sorry that's what i meant yeah it should be seven sorry they're not yeah, gonna but play okay. that. Gonna play because that. when your opponent play gambit then he know this line okay there is some gambit line this is gambit line yeah okay that's why i show you okay but because you don't tell me that you do, your level do not play but obviously play because your level people like to play game with. Yeah. I don't Even have any problem with queen b3 or knight f3. I could, I could feel okay playing either move, honestly. Yeah, because you don't know here well the, 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 so here you can play this. Yeah. E5. This is not easy to play for white here. I've been in this position as white <laughs> a couple different times. Try not to get my queen trapped. Looks uh, pawn takes. Yeah. Bishop takes. Yeah. So you, you cannot take with pawn. Pawn take with you lost. Yeah. yeah, can you lose your queen? So because you don't take it, play just rook okay, right. then I'd be fine. Uh -oh. so, bishop so you need to take with actually a uh, bishop. Wait, 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 hold on. Why is that uh, context line lost? Show, show, show me. Uh, rook C8, uh, Rook B8. Uh, yeah. I'm not sure if you're miss C. Then but if I find a sister, it is that block at the you, a, a back which of diagonal. Okay, we need it, the only move. Yeah, Rook B2, he can play. Well, 95 also play. If you take, then you can just move this line. Bishop. Oh, that too, yeah. Are you going to push up before? Queen f6 also winning. Oh, yeah, man, there's, there's a lot of winning moves. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. This is a disaster. Bishop before, yeah. There's just, just a lot. My falls apart. Okay, so this is the problem actually. Even 95 we can play, okay? This is also good for. So, we show you five is the only thing. So, 95. Rook B8. Queen A7. Knight E4. So you need to play accurate. No, man. I'm never going to play like this, personally. This seems way too but dangerous. I... Bishop C4. Yeah, you don't play, I know. Yeah, Ooh, I told you that. This is not bad, actually, for black. If you take, you need to play... When Bishop D6 is very tricky line. Yeah, no. Let's just let's just stick with Knight F3. Okay, after Bishop D3, you didn't take Queen B7, so there is no problem there. Okay, right. so... Okay, so you can play with uh, Queen B3 also. Then, yeah. When your opponent is unguided, you can play Queen B3, okay? Good. You know this, my opponent, you know, we study too much, so you know everything. So then you can play right after the guitar. Right. Okay. So you six. Yeah, so you can play bishop d5 or, yeah, I like this bishop d5 more, okay. The, most of the player play bishop d3, but yeah, I like bishop d5. I need to pressure my opponent. Uh, what, yeah. what do you do if they play queen b6? I guess it queen b6 doesn't really threaten anything. Never mind, yeah, never mind. Yeah, queen a4. 
That's what I would play. Or even I mean, you can, you can, can, you can, you can just castle. Problem. Yeah, I thought for some reason Queen B six attacks the bishop, but never mind. It's a stupid move. No, even if play six, you can just move this. Yeah. Uh, your pawn has to take. Ooh. This is better for actually white. Yeah. Because now you need to take. Yeah, you cannot play b5. Okay, because I take with knight when you play b5. Right. Okay, you cannot take with pawn because I take with c, rook takes c six. When you take queen, I take rook c eight also. So you cannot take also rook c on. Even I can play like, yeah, I can check queen d six. Look, I don't need to actually do this. I can just move this my knight to c three and take your queen. Already, this is winning for actually. You didn't show this is the winning for actually. Sorry. That's why here you need to take with this big win, with the pawn. Yeah, but here you can play 95. 95. Yeah. Because you stop bishop b3, also you are telling to take 90 c6. Yeah, you can show me seven. You want you just castle. D three you can play, okay, but yeah. Look F C on. So yeah, castle. Sorry. Yeah, after castle, this is the move. Queen B3, this is the better for actually. Why? Because when you take, I take with pawn, okay. But okay, when you play rook B8, okay, this is actually not going to my better position for me. But you don't have never play rook B8. Because my bishop on f4. Okay. Mm -hmm. When you take this, okay, how to actually protect a6 and c6 pawn? Okay, that's why. Even the next move I play with knight f a4. Okay, the rook b3, queen b3 this is a very tricky position. You can move here actually. Mm -hmm. So, okay, later we can uh, we can discuss and more things about this opening. Yeah. So actually, this class is actually finished here. So, hello? Yeah, I'm here. Okay, you have any, any questions, so you can ask me. Okay, even Calvin also. Okay. <laughs> Um, no, no questions right now. Thank you. Yeah, I think it's pressure. Okay, yeah. we just start this opening. Okay, just we are not actually going to tip also. Okay, yeah. later we can discuss any other move. Okay, lots of move here. Yeah. Bishop f5. Even here, Bishop g4. Someone play Bishop g4 here still. Maybe here. Mm. Oh, G6. Now this is the new trend. Maybe learning now. This is. This is how I play against this, in fact. Yeah. This is a new. Okay. So we can discuss yeah. a lot of things here. 
From the black side, when this happens, I do play G6 myself. Okay, yeah. Because when Karokan player, even he can play this. Right. Karokan, some experience videos on uh, this type of stuff is coming here. Yeah, it's not the best for black, though, in my opinion. I, at least I haven't had the best results with it. Like, black okay, play in this opening is kind of hard. Black. What is the best for black? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, we can look at that as black, because I struggle with this a lot as black. Yeah, but Karokan player like to play G6, but G6 is not here because sometimes that happen in the game. Like white play knight 3 and going to play knight e5. Okay. Mm -hmm. He play very slowly actually. He play rook c8, e8. Okay, knight e5. You need to take and he take with bishop. Okay, so after take with bishop, when you exchange this, you cannot move f6 knight. So when you move this f6 knight, he can take bishop g6. Sorry, bishop g7. Okay. Mm -hmm. After that, he doing actually, he can play for black. Black is mm -hmm. weakness. Okay. There is not too much actually for white. Yeah. But there is actually comfortable for white. Okay. He don't have a lo uh, lo losing option. Yes. He don't have actually not better. I told you that he don't have better anymore. But yeah. But there, there is no losing chance for white. Okay. Okay. But that's a white play, this. Yeah, makes sense. Yeah, from the white side, this this is, I've always done fine with it. I've never had any issues. Very yeah. easy to play. Yeah, why white actually play for this, this type of kind of opening? Your opponent play very comfortable. He don't want it to play initiative. He just play for actually small initiative and he just uh, like he don't wanted to actually get he actually he believe he, he, his self and he play normal chess he don't wanted to fight and he don't wanted to go some complication okay yeah so he and gets a small initiative and he wanted to actually convert this initiative Right. Okay, so Kelvin, do you have any question? Uh, have you seen lines instead of a uh, bishop f4 where you go to uh, bishop? Uh, oh, bishop f4. Instead of bishop b4, uh, sorry, bishop f4, uh, bishop g5, and then queen c2. And if you're, the idea is you're going to castle queen side and attack the king side. As white. Attack king side. Yeah. So but but the thing is this is not attacking position. Okay, when you attack in very early then this is going to be bad for you. Because it's the uh, structure wise open. Okay. When you have lots of peace and lots of pawn and then you can attack something like this. But yeah, there is no nothing actually here. Okay. The position is very actually dry and very easy position for both sides. Okay, when your position is easy, then you, when you're up, when both sides have same thing, when he attack, when you white attack, then white position is going to bad. Because when you push a complex, then you can do something. Okay, when you have the complication, okay, but there is no complication to attack or something like that. Okay. okay. So you need to mm -hmm. actually complicate the position, then you can attack something like this. Otherwise, yeah, this is not actually attacking. This step is not good. Okay, not best. Okay, you can attack, but it's not best. Okay, even engine cannot actually suggest this. Yeah. Yeah, but in your variation, yeah, the bishop g5, and sometimes you can attack. Okay. In Kelvin, you are playing main variation. Okay, so sometimes even you are opponent even white play G4 directly. Okay, you just sack G4 board. Mm -hmm. Okay, but this variation, yeah, this is not easy to attack. Okay. Yeah, I just had a line uh, I used to play where it was like Bishop G5 and then Pawns got to E3 and then Bishop uh, E3 and yeah. Like okay, yeah. Actually, you can stop the record. 
Okay. You, yeah. I, I, I get what you're saying. I get what you're saying, though. There's no weak 